Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are set to attend the upcoming Invictus Games despite furious royal family fans airing their anger after the pair snubbed Prince Philip's memorial service. Prince Harry and wife Meghan Markle have been chastised by fuming royal family fans for snubbing the memorial service of Prince Philip. The pair were rumored to be attending the Invictus Games just days after Harry had snubbed the memorial service of his grandfather the Duke of Edinburgh over security concerns. His upcoming attendance at the Invictus Games ceremony has sparked controversy and plenty of anger among royal family fans on Twitter. The new round of rage from royal fans comes after his wife Meghan is now expected to attend the Invictus Games alongside the Duke of Sussex. One irate commenter accused Meghan of following the spotlight, writing on the social media app Of course she will, cameras light action. Some fans are convinced the Philip Memorial snub was partly due to the upcoming Netflix documentary Harry and Meghan are working on with attending the service not an option for the streaming giant's camera crew. Another user tweeted of the happy coincidence that meant a camera crew would follow the Duke and Duchess of Sussex to the Invictus Games event but not the memorial service. A number of people expressed their annoyance at the security concern claims Harry had made as a reason for not attending the memorial of his grandfather. Hearing the news of the Duke of Sussex's expected attendance at the sporting event, one user wrote, I take it there's no problem with security then. Another user wrote, safe for them going to the games but not safe going to the memorial? Meghan confirmed yesterday that she would be attending the sporting event for wounded, injured and sick servicemen alongside her husband Harry. Myers said it was ludicrous for the Sussexes to not visit the Queen in London, given that England it's just an hour away from the Netherlands. Harry insists it is too dangerous to bring his family over to the UK, but feels perfectly safe in the United States and other European countries. Myers continued, he skipped Prince Philip's memorial. The rest of the royal family were there. There were royals from all over Europe and still Harry and Meghan couldn't be bothered to turn up. It's ridiculous. Langdon responded, it's getting harder and harder to defend them. Stefanovic then fumed, I can't even look at them. I used to like Harry, and even Meghan back in the day. In August last year, Stefanovic memorably cringed when Langdon mentioned Prince Harry's name on air. Langdon was introducing the Today Show's next guest. Global Citizen founder Hugh Evans, when she revealed he had worked alongside the Duke of Sussex. Our next guest is a Melbourne man with the likes of Lady Gaga, Hugh Jackman and Prince Harry all on speed dial, she said. Prince Harry? Stefanovic winced before bursting into laughter. Langdon responded, well, once upon a time, you would have liked Prince Harry on speed dial. Yes, I know, I know. I love him, he said before continuing the segment. Carl Stefanovic has never been afraid to criticize the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. And the Today host, 47, slammed Prince Harry and Meghan Markle yet again on Wednesday while discussing their visit to the Netherlands for the Invictus Games.